Alright, I finally have GR Deck 2 working properly. I had to set up a virtual machine running Zubuntu, and I've compiled and installed only what I need to make this work. So, it has uh, GNU Radio, it has GR Deck, and it has the supporting dependencies, and I haven't installed anything else other than that. And I've gotten the audio, audio quality perfect. We've got my usual 6.0 phone from VTech, and then underneath this here, this guy with the lights is a Cisco um, SIP to POTS line adapter so that the phone thinks it's actually attached to a phone line. And I have a config menu I can dial into so that way I can hear um, both sides. <clears throat> and as usual, VTech doesn't encrypt anything because they suck. Don't buy VTech. All right. Um, I did also have to do modifications in my chooser. I had to go into the documentation and find the frequency list for the US because the software only supported EU. So let's try this again. I just reset my HackRF, so hopefully it sees it this time, and it does. We're going to back off the IF gain. It starts too high. Um, same with the VGA gain. And I'm probably going to be around channel 23, 24. And you can see it actually already sees a phone there. So I'm curious. We're actually going to go to three. My phone's not on. And it might just be um, my audio, or excuse me, my my settings being a little bit off. But we're going to turn on the phone, dial into my config menu. Option menu. Please enter. Option. Follow by... So now we can see the portable part is on zero changes to zero and it is coming through let me turn up my volume so that's coming from the phone and if I switch it to part one that's going to come from the handset or the base to menu please enter option followed by the pound key so in my box, if I want to get the IP address. Configuration menu, please. One one zero one nine two dot one six eight dot zero dot one eight. Configuration menu. We'll drop please out of the menu. Enter option followed by the pound key. Cancelled. I'm going to switch back to the portable part, and we're going to talk into the phone. So, works pretty well. Audio quality is pretty good. And we're going to see if we can replicate that on a uh, triple E PC. And if I can, uh, it should get interesting. But I want to try and develop this up a bit, get the scanning features in here, fix the sliders, and uh, adjust a couple things so that it's not crazy sensitive as well as making sure that the um, list comes up properly because even though I've changed it in uh, the source I still have to manually change it in the flow graph so I have some other changes I have to publish but uh, progress is being made